to Art with Miss V. Today, we have a very, very exciting class for you. Or maybe I should say it's a very exciting class. Get it? Berry? <laughs> Berry? I thought it was kind of funny. All you have to do is just follow along with me. Remember, your drawing does not have to look just like my drawing. Just try your best. So, grab a piece of paper and a pencil, of course. And if you have a marker or some crayons that you can color with, that would be fabulous. We are gonna draw something really fun. We're gonna have so much fun. What color socks do bears wear? They don't wear any socks, they have bare feet. What did the teddy bear say after dinner? I'm stuffed. Can you guess what we're gonna draw? Can you guess, can you guess? What could it be? That's right, it's a bear. How did you know? Okay, fine, it's a bear. But I'm not gonna tell you what kind of bear. Let's start with a large circle in the middle of our paper and that's gonna be our panda's head. Make sure you draw large and fill the space. Now let's draw the panda's nose. It's just a small oval. Now for his mouth, let's draw a J and a backwards J. Now we'll draw two large ovals for the dark area around the panda's eyes or his mask. Let's give him circle eyes, and inside the eyes we'll draw a smaller circle for the highlight. Now let's draw ears like a C on each side. give him some arms. They're going to slightly slant inward. Let's give him some big feet on each side. Now let's do a background. I think I'm gonna draw my panda sitting in a bamboo patch. Where will your panda be?
Don't forget to color it in. Your panda doesn't have to be black and white. It can be any color you want. What do you call a bear with no teeth? Give up? A gummy bear! <laughs> what do you get when you cross a skunk with a bear? Winnie the Pooh! <laughs> We're going to repeat the same shape for the inside of the ear. <laughs> <laughs> 